Hi, and welcome to the second in a series of videos highlighting the latest feature releases for G Suite and Chromebooks. My name is Dean Stokes, I'm the UK Director at Apps Events, and this week we're going to talk about using Android apps on Chromebooks. Recently in London, I was showing educators the wonders of Google's new Jamboard that has an accompanying Android app allowing students to collaborate on a whiteboard no matter where they are in the world. Today though, we're going to focus on Google's Science Journal Android app running on my Acer Chromebook R11. So I'm going to choose the Play Store icon from my shelf here and that opens up the restricted version of the Play Store where my administrator has pre-installed a few Android apps. So I choose Science Journal and I open it up here and here we go. To create a new experiment, I click the plus. Here's the screen where I can write an observation, but I'm actually going to switch over here to the sensors on the device. So the first one here is the microphone, and this is giving me a reading of the amount of sound that the device is hearing. And now I've switched over to the accelerometer, which measures movement. So on the Z axis here, as I move the Chromebook up and down, you can see it takes a reading. And I've hit the record button at the bottom of the screen, which allows me to record the readings. And when I hit stop, that adds it to the experiment here for me to come back to later. Now it might also be helpful for me to add a comment here so I could add some comments as I go through the experiment and post those there too. And I can even switch over to the front facing camera on the Chromebook R11 and take a picture of the experiment I'm doing, or in this case, my face and then I can tap the pencil icon on the top right to give the experiment a name. So this would be perfect for something like a 21st century egg drop, where we wrap the Chromebook in different material inside a box and drop it to see which material causes the least movement. Now the Science General team have also created an excellent website of resources linking out to a number of different places that give you ideas for experiments you can run using the app. So there you have it, using the Science Journal Android app running on a Chromebook to enable experiments in your classroom. I can't wait to see what all of you start doing now that we can run Android apps on Chromebooks, and I'll see you again soon.